Hi everyone, it's Tammy and it's time to do my flip through for the week of Monday or the week of September 16th through 22nd. So Monday, it was a busy week. Monday I worked from home and I finished Into the Fire, a documentary by on Netflix that was really good. I forgot to put a sticker there, didn't I? Chris had a doctor's appointment and all of that turned out well. Roxy went to the groomer. I worked on food party planning for Chris's birthday party, which was Sunday, the 22nd. Um, I ordered some Etsy, or no, or some Etsy stuff arrived. I could finally hear better. That was so nice. My ear had been like clogged up and it felt so much better. I got some happy mail. Um, we swung by and picked up our friend Dave and Esther, and then we went to Total Wine and Carmel, uh, which is just a a city here in Indiana and uh, that was fun and then we went to Charleston's for dinner and it was a great time um, oh Chris took Roxy to the market to the little market here in town and she stayed on the golf cart while he got out and uh, did what he did to do in the market I think he was buying drinks um, which is what we usually do we'll go up there and get a polar pop and she stayed on the golf cart she was so good and my Lush Advent arrived. So I have a lot of Advents that I'm going to be doing for Christmas. And some of them are arriving already. And I'm excited about that. Let's see. Tuesday, I worked at the office. I did stop at McDonald's and get some breakfast. Chris went and got his hair cut. I finished a cozy mystery called Needle to Death. It was really good. And I started The Family Remains, which is also really good. Um, this was a cozy mystery. This one is by Lisa Jewell. I worked on getting some party supplies together. Chris came home early. Alex um, thinks he's going to be going to Ivy Tech in the spring, so that's awesome. I ordered some shoes for the kids for Advent. Um, I'm doing, I don't think they're going to watch this, but I'm doing a sock Advent calendar for each of the kids. So every day of December, they can open up a new pair of socks, and then their gift on Christmas Day is going to be a new pair of shoes. Um, Starbies was triple stars. I went there. Ta um, Chris had a town board meeting and um, I brought home McAllister's for dinner. I did not go to the town board meeting. I just hung out and watched Netflix, I guess. Is this the day that I... No, I didn't. I, I don't know what I did, but I didn't go to the board meeting. I know that. Wednesday, um, I worked from home. Chris went in late, which was nice. Uh, cause he's been going in early. It's, he's, he's had crazy time at work. I've had crazy time at work. I talked with Tracy. It was trash day. I ordered some groceries for, from, uh, Kroger for our birthday party. I watched the circle. I got some party favors made. I ordered the Wooble advent. Um, Alex came home because he was looking at a place in Lafayette, which he did not like at all. But, um, we went out to Moe's for lunch and then for dinner, we went over to Dave's house and Esther made a German dinner and it was so nice. She did sausages on the grill with potato salad and, um, um, uh, mushroom or not mushrooms, mozzarella and tomatoes. It was, it was a really good dinner. It was really, really good. So there was that. Um, and Esther is from Germany. She's, well, she's from Germany. She lives in Switzerland and she is here visiting Dave. So uh, we have been able to spend a little time with her, which has been a real treat. Thursday, I worked from home. I filmed a video. I watched, I started watching Netflix Monsters, the Menendez Brothers. I hadn't remembered their story. I know I used to know a little bit about it, but I did not know as much about it as I learned. I couldn't even finish it on one day. It's very intense and it's like eight episodes. Some of them are an hour, some of them are a half hour, but I, oh, whew, it was a lot. And I just like to have the TV on when I'm working lots of times. And so I don't exactly see everything, but I usually hear and, you know, that's how I usually do it. I'll listen to a book or I'll listen to YouTube and just let the TV go just so I'm not feeling alone. I paid some bills. I did some menu planning. We went and got our nails done. I only got a petty because my fingernails are, as you can see, needing to be healed. They are in a state of repair right now. Um, I worked on Octobink. I love that little uh, sticker. Oh, what's his name? I forget all of a sudden. 
oh goodness, the Happy Little Trees guy, but that's who that is, and I think it's adorable. Um, we went to El Maison for dinner, and I put Michelada for me, and I sang it, so I put little music notes around it. Bob Ross, there we go. Uh, let's see, Friday the 20th, um, I finished the Monsters, whoo, worked from home, I worked on Octobink, and there's a little cute, she's drawing too, Chris came home early and surprised us with Chick-fil-A, he, um, came home and he brought stuff for Roxy, a salad for me, it was great, but work is crazy busy, so I, you know, ate and came back upstairs and worked and worked, and it was, it's been crazy, but it's okay. It's all part of it. Um, I did get some happy mail from Shine Sticker Studio. I did work a little bit on the blanket of knowledge, my knitting. I haven't been knitting very much. I worked, did my eyebrows. We ate dinner outside. We went and got Bruno's Pizza, and that was nice. It was a real treat, and we sat on the deck and, on the, yes, on the deck and ate. And we took a golf cart ride. So our Friday was pretty, at least at night, it was pretty easy, which was much needed. And then Saturday, we seemed like we did a lot. Saturday too, we um, ate some leftover pizza, but we, on the porch in the morning, and then we went to buy some pumpkins and some mums at one of the local farms. Chris weed eated, I decorated for fall. I only did the porch, I haven't done the inside because I'm thinking I probably need to decorate for Halloween first. And I didn't wanna do all that knowing that I had a party on Sunday. So I had a party the next day. So I just had too much in the house and going on. So I wanted to wait. So maybe I'll start decorating a little bit now, but I need to put away party stuff first. But anyway, I did decorate the porch and it does look really pretty. I, though I think I wanna add some corn stalks but um, I haven't gotten those yet, but they should be right. I mean, we have corn everywhere around here, so I should it shouldn't be too hard to get. And Chris put the fire pit chairs together. It looks great. Alex is home for good, so yay, thank goodness. He is home and happy, and whew, he starts working tomorrow, and it's all going to be fabulous. God is so good. Uh, Chris and I sat on the front porch. I actually took a nap this day. Then we went to dinner at Dave's and some of his family was there and it was so much fun. She made another German meal. This was pork and um, she had these crispy egg, not egg, cheese crumpets or something. I don't remember what she called them, but they were so good. And she made deviled eggs with salmon. Oh, it was delicious. I mean, it was really, 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 really good. And then um, came home and I started the carnitas in the crock pot. And then Sunday was Chris's party. And oh my goodness, it was so much fun. So we had a taco party. We took everything to the church and, had, and used the church basement for our party. And we had... Um, tacos with all the fixings and we did carnitas and chicken and beef and it was just fabulous. Alex and Delaney were there and Delaney brought us some buffalo dip and uh, Katie wasn't feeling well so unfortunately she didn't get to come which I was really bummed out about but we had a great great party. It was so much fun and he really enjoyed it. The only thing he said was that he everything was perfect except where was his bounce house? <laughs> which was pretty funny because he he was being sarcastic but it was great and then we watched uh the next episode of Tulsa King when we got home and or when we yeah I guess it was home we got home and settled and oh my goodness I am still tired from this party it, it's a lot to get everything ready get it somewhere have the party clean it all up get some get it back home wash everything get it all put away I still have to work on putting some of the stuff away I have I've washed I think everything um I just need to put it all away now but and that's okay it's and it was so worth it because there's no one that's more worthy Chris was fabulous it was great and he turned 60 so happy birthday sweetheart and then today is Monday, so we'll see what this week brings, but woo, last week was sure fun and busy, and I'm not real sure anything can top it right now, but we'll see. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope that you guys have a great week, and I will include some pictures here at the end of some of our fun. So thank you. Bye-bye.